Brittany, teenagers and parents in Asbury Park are waiting right now to hear if there will be a high school football season. They've been meeting with district officials. The season is in jeopardy because too many players were ruled ineligible. One game already canceled. News 12 New Jersey's Chris Keating is live now with an update. Chris. Nick, the next game for the Asbury Park High School football, football team is supposed to be played on Friday. It's a home game right here at the stadium. But with three days left to go, right now there's absolutely no indication they'll have enough players. The Blue Bishops should be at practice today, getting ready for their home game with Keyport. But the varsity squad does not have enough eligible players to suit up, something that came to light right before last Friday's first game. Asbury Park was forced to forfeit the game with weak wake. The superintendent Rashawn Adams has told us it has come to my attention during the last few weeks of doing athletic eligibility that we have many students who are not eligible to participate in fall sports. This is a very difficult situation as heartbreaking as it is. I could not knowingly send players to play who are ineligible. Team members and their parents have told us they're upset and have so far been left in the dark as to what's going to happen with the rest of this season. Eligibility for players comes into question when you take into account whether or not a student has passing grades. Do they live in the town where they actually go to school and are they eligible by age? I've been told that today's meetings took place between district officials along with the coaching staff. We've also been told that there will be no update today concerning those meetings. We should tell you that Thursday is the first day of school here in Asbury Park. In Asbury Park, I'm Chris Keating, News 12 New Jersey.